Hi, I'm Miss Megan from Cooper Siegel Community Library, and today I want to show you the different nonfiction titles that are available through Hoopla. So we're going to start out at our website, coopersiegelcommunitylibrary.org, and click Research and Education, and then click All Databases. This will pull up the full list of electronic resources that are available through the Allegheny County Library Association. And we're going to scroll down to Hoopla and click Go. If you haven't already signed into Hoopla, you're going to create an account using your library card. If you run into any trouble with that, feel free to give us a phone call or an email and we will help walk you through that process. And then once you have an account, you have access to a wide variety of different things, audiobooks, movies, music, comics, ebooks, and television. So lots of fun things to take a look at. I'm going to specifically highlight some nonfiction titles because one of the things that I love about Hoopla is that all of the content is available all the time. And so if you run into a situation where you want to look up something specific um, on a nonfiction topic with your child, it's a really easy way to do that. So for example, you can see some of the things that I've searched recently, which are music and science and water and paper airplanes and optical illusions. Um, I've been searching a lot of things to get background information for the DIY STEM kits that we've been doing. So these are the things I've searched for. I'm gonna go ahead and click on optical illusions and tell it to search. And as you can see, there's some nice content. You have a bunch of different eBooks that you can take a look at that walk you through this. Um, and as I said, you can, there's no waiting for borrowing it. So I'm gonna go ahead and borrow. And now I can go ahead and read this title. I'm gonna give you a snapshot of what this book looks like. So I'm gonna to go to chapters and click this one about things being in perspective. And so it gives you some information about what's going on with that optical illusion, and you can keep reading about different optical illusions that way. It's a really nice book. It's very useful for this type of thing. Um, the Hoopla in general is really great to kind of play around with and see what content you can find. So test it out and let us know if you need any help. I hope this makes it easier for you to track down some science topics and other nonfiction topics that interest you and your child.